I stop and stare at you, and girl, I fall in love. Oh, girl, I wanna make him mine. Come on, move your body. Just let me be with the woman that I love. Come on, move your body. Whoa! Grounded 1.3, this is a new update. Yeah, yeah. Hello, welcome back to another Mother Jealous video. It's me, it's Liam. Oh, look how great this camera work is. It stretched my face this way, and you could barely see my amazing, luscious locks of hair. Anyway, this is Grounded 1.3, obviously. What else is it going to be? You've read the title, you've seen the thumbnail, you know what it is. Now, I imagine Obsidian have probably shown you some of this stuff or how it works. They might not have. Some other Grounded YouTubers have probably shown you this sort of stuff but you know I'm gonna do it but I'm gonna be weird because that is what we do uh, so I have made a small little map sort of showcasing the funny things sort of like an escape room because I want to make some of these now this is gonna be difficult because it's gonna take a long time to make these you can't just like flip them out in like a couple of hours because they'll be quite trashy like this one you'll see this one's gonna be crap but it's gonna be good so anyway I'm gonna shut up and I'm gonna start playing it but before I do Subscribe! Subscribe to this channel and go and check out some of the other amazing content if you're new here because of the update. Hello, welcome. I'm Liam. Nice to meet you. How's it going? Right, anyway, into the video. Into the video. Whip. I'll do like a little whip and it'll go whoosh. Are ready? Whoosh. So right now, as you can see, all of this crap. Ignore this. Pretty much what this orange thing or red thing is here is to stop me leaving the map. So I haven't put a roof on it to keep it nice and bright so you can see what's going on. But I've put this here because I'm in, I'm in design mode at the moment. And then if I do this, I'm now in play mode and watch. Boom. See, I can't jump out. That is one of the really cool things I like about this. Um, but anyway, this is my map. So let's get started. Welcome to the new grounded update. Oh, oh. Hello guys, welcome. There you go, there you go. My message, my message to me and to you guys. Welcome, good welcome. Your favourite character. Now, obviously, as you can see, I'm Pete. I always choose Pete if, if he's available. So, I'm going to choose Pete. Boom, it's open. But, see this? It's locked. It is locked. This one is locked because that is not right. And if I press that, I didn't connect it to anything, so it won't go through. Right, so now I'm going to do something called acting. Or I'm gonna act like I don't know what happens in this map, okay? Ah, oh, Pete, my favorite one. I love Pete so much. Right, here we go. Are you the best grounded creator? Obviously. Obviously. <laughs> right, so, so as you can see here, we've got yes, and we've got no. We've got little biometric scanners here, and I don't like the look of this, um, this little electric tower. So I'm gonna go for yes, because that's the obvious answer here. And I expect the door to open or something. No, no. Um, that wasn't in the script. I was meant to run away before I died. And now I just look stupid. But, but we go again, we go again. Oh, for God's sake, this is not in the script. Look how far away I am. Oh, oh, you fool. Give me a second, guys. I'm going to have to get into handy nap mode. And hey, look at this. This is cool, though. So look by my big fat head. If you look to the side of my big fat head, look, I can slow him down. Or I can speed him up with a mouse wheel. You can see I built it all the way over there. Good thinking. And didn't set a spawn point. Good thinking. But um, whoever made this map, come on, set some spawn points, yeah? And if I go out of handy nap mode midair, bang! It's me. I'm Pete again. And now Pete's just fallen down there. But ignore him. No one cares about Pete. Right, so favorite character, Pete. Unlocked. Opened. Are you the best grounded creator? I said yes. Clearly, I'm not. Which is obviously wrong. Right, guys? Comment comment below. Comment below your favorite grounded YouTubers. I'll be actually very, um, very, very eager to know who you say. If you say Jade or Paralyze, I swear to God. I swear to God. But there we go. It's opened up and you can hear the little cheering sound. You hear the little cheering sound. That's pretty cool, isn't it? I added that myself. I mean, the, the creator of the map added that. Not me. Not me. Right, here we go. So this is open, walk through. You suck. <laughs> okay, thank you. That sums it up, the best grounded creator, you suck. See here, through this little thing here, there is a, um, it comes into view there. Uh, ignore all this stuff over here. What's got a little storage basket? And you look at that, I've got an arrow and I've also got a little bow here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm guessing, I'm guessing hmm, <laughs> that this, this, uh, this target here might be linked to this, me thinks. Um, is me correct? Boom. Me is correct. Me is great. All right, now we're into our next room. I'll close the door behind me because I'm not a piece of trash. So, we've got a load of explosive bird traps here, which doesn't seem good. It doesn't seem good, does it? 
No, it doesn't. As you can see here, identify the sound. Identify the sound. Don't ask me why that's gone so dark. You can just about see it. it shouldn't be that dark. So press the little button. You can hear that. Do you know what that is? <laughs> right. <laughs> I'm laughing because I made this and I can't actually remember. <laughs> I made this yesterday. You lot are going to be like raging right now. Is it a firefly? It's definitely not that little weird thing. But these are pressure pa these are pressure plates. Um, and you can see all these traps, so you can sort of put put two and two together. I'm gonna go for this bad bad boy. Okay, we've learned something today. I've learned that it's not the firefly, and you guys have learned that I'm I'm horribly bad at grounded, which. I was about to say, if you've seen my content before, you already know this. The only thing I didn't do, or the stupid creator of this map uh, didn't do, is make them respawn. So now I can just sort of like... Definitely not that one. Definitely not that one. So it was the B. Okay, it's the B. And now this one should be unlocked. And it opens! It opens! Amazing, amazing, amazing. And we come in here... On a scale from 1 to 9, where do you live? Again. You'd like to think I know which button to press, <laughs> but I've completely forgotten again. So we go from one down here, all these buttons are linked. So these are obviously linked, let's be honest, they're going to be linked, aren't they? I can't remember! This doesn't even make any sense! On a scale from one to nine, where do you live? What's this? What am I going to do? Why am I getting angry? I made this! I made this! Why am I getting angry at myself? I don't know, free? It's not free. It's not free. <laughs> oh, I'm such an idiot. I should have I should have written this down. Oh, I remember this bit. So what I did here was a nice little bit of trickery. It's not really trickery. Uh, you can set your spawn point. So I've got a spawn point there. You obviously can't see it. But if I go like this, ruin the immersion, I've got all of this stuff linked up to here. So what this does is this triggers this spawn point. So as soon as I press the, the wrong button, it will trigger this. I could follow these lines and figure out which one's right, but irrelevant. So yeah, when I press the wrong button, it triggers the spawn point to activate. So, so before that, it's not activated. So if I die, I'm not going to spawn here like you saw I spawned in a random place. But as soon as I acti activate the wrong ones and the traps go off, I'm probably going to die. So it activates this spawn point. So now I will spawn back here. But we know it's not free. Let's go nine. Not nine either. And I died again. See, and I spawn back here as well. The, the, the lasers, like, the lasers hit you a little bit. A little bit, a little bit. Come on, lads. <laughs> right, nine. It's not nine. It's not three. No, no, no. Let's go six. Seven. Let's go seven. I died. I died again. <laughs> I've set, I'm going to die again. I've set a low timer on all these lasers, but these have a longer timer. Um... Oh, screw it. I'm just going to make my way down. So I've done seven, nine. I'll go eight, then I'll go six, and I'll just make my way down through. Hey! It was eight. It was eight the whole time. Have no reason why it was eight. Makes no sense. Are you gay? <laughs> I can see that one already. You're an embarrassment. And the only option I have is I know. Yeah. I don't really want to press it, so I'm just going to... Oh, okay, I know. I know I'm an embarrassment. Obviously, you can see this trashy content I'm making right here. Are you gay? Are you gay? And everything is really dark. It's really... So that is yes. That's no. Obviously, I'm going to go for no. Okay. No, I'm not gay. Seemed to be the correct answer. And here. Lying again, are we? <laughs> I crack myself up. I crack myself up. Um, and now a little potty teleport. Telepotty is activated. So I walk through the telepotty. Boom. In a different place. Different place completely. Boom. And I'm back in this place again. That's pretty cool. That's cool. Boom. Anyway. Right. Are you sure you're not gay? Again, apologies for this, like, text. It is meant to be clearer, but for some reason it's it's just, it's messing up. The early stages of the game. Are you sure you're not gay? Yes, I'm sure I'm not gay. Yes, I'm pretty sure I'm not gay. Don't you dare make stupid little comments. Ah! 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 Yeah, I'm getting... Punished for lying again. I was taken down by a spiderling. And now I respawn. I respawn here and the sp oh, spooky, the spiderlings have gone. Now this is an another lovely bit of trickery that I will I will go through. So pretty much I've set it up. So this is linked to this 
and it's also linked to this door and it's also linked to the spawn point in here and if I go back into design mode boom you can see all this stuff going off here so I've got all of the spawners so if I press yes because I'm lying that I am actually gay even though I'm not and because I'm being a lying piece of crap it will spawn these bugs in to kill me and then once they kill me I spawn it activates the um I go into here and you see there's a little sphere in there and what this little sphere does is it activates whatever I want it to. So as soon as I hit that sphere, it activates the teleporter to go off. It activates all the bug spawners to despawn and it activates this little spawn point here. So it's pretty decent when that goes off, it activates a little spawn point and then in turn that deactivates the spawners and it also deactivates the teleporter so I can't go through. But because I've gone into design mode, I'll go back into play mode and it's all back to normal again. So what I'll have to do, it just completely resets it. So what I'll have to do, I'll show you it again, is I press yes, I'm sure. See, it's working now. It's nice and clear. That's how it should be. Yes, I'm sure I'm not gay. And they spawn back in. And now you can see it in action. Attack me. Attack me for being a lying... A liar. A liar. Ah! Take me as I am. A gay man. Ah. Ah. Say ah. Homophobes, goddamn homophobes, all you spiderlings. Here we go, I've, I've, I've triggered it. Bang, they're gone. Teleport's off, I can't get back through. I'm stuck here now, I'm stuck here. And so, are you sure you're not gay? No, I'm sure I, I'm, I'm not sure that I'm gay. So there we go, this opens up. Uh, and now it says, are you gay? Yes, God yes is the only option here. So I can't really do anything other than press this button. So I press this. Up, you know they're happy for me because I'm actually owning it you know uh, and then we walk down here after I've just let everyone know that I'm a, a homosexual oh oh what's this you see a, a lovely little armor dummy bent over there and I <laughs> look at that so he's got cummy bum <laughs> oh no look at all that cum coming out of his bum uh, yeah yeah. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Take it! Yeah! Get all that cum out of that bum! Ah! There we go. Well, I've had enough fun with that anyway. Uh, and. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I haven't seen it from this angle yet. I swear it wasn't that cho. <laughs> you like that? That's changed. There was no way it was that thick. Like, that is a chode and a half right there. That is massive. Look at the testicles compared to the shaft. That's that's crazy. Um, anyone underage watching this, uh, turn off. Don't watch me. <laughs> so you like that? Uh, yeah, I do, actually. I really like that. Right, so I've just done a bit of editing. That's, that's what it should have looked like. But for some reason... When I saved it and came back into it, it's like massive. In the time that I made it yesterday and now, it got an erection and it was just huge. So so let's try it again. Let's get it in and hopefully this works this time. And Oh look, it did a come. It did a come. And then boom, it shoots a little a little firework out of its penis. Woo! Woo! Let's do that again. That was pretty cool. Woo! Do that come. Come. Doing a come. Doing a come. And then extract it from his bum again. As you can see, this is probably why they don't choose any of my stuff to showcase for the new update. <laughs> I'm banned. I'm going to be banned if they ever see this. I really hope they don't watch this. I'm making a mockery. I'm not making a mockery of their um, new update. I'm just pushing the limits of what I can get away with. <laughs> Look at that. You like that. But yeah, that's that. That's that so far. If I go into little handy nap boy. You can see what I sort of made here. The whole map wasn't covered up with these giant blocks because I couldn't be bothered to do it. Um, but yeah, that's that. You can see all the links here, the blue links going up to it. I'm not going to do a tutorial on how to use them. They're fairly self-explanatory. Like, once you get in, it took me, what, like 10 minutes and I sort of figured it out by myself. It's fairly easy. There's better people that will probably make better tutorials than this crap. This was this was just a little showcase of, of what you can make in it. I am going to start right now, as soon as I finish this, making something even better. I'm probably going to try and make, make James or Marcus try it out, so it should be good. But what I'm going to wait for is this to actually be released, because at the moment I'm playing the Steam version. And there are a lot of problems that came with it, but yeah. I'm going to make some other stuff. I'm going to upload some other stuff, so make sure you check it out. Make sure you like, subscribe as well if you haven't already, and I will see you soon. I'm just going to quickly go in and get a nice view of that phallus-shaped object there. And uh, goodbye. Goodbye. Bye.